The footage posted by the Huta Media Center activist group shows protesters running for shelter after coming under fire by armed rebels. At least 12 people were wounded in that incident in eastern Huta, just outside the capital, Damascus. The infighting among opposition factions continues in eastern Ghouta for the fourth day. People are preparing to go out for another protest, and they will head to clashes points. Unfortunately, the group of Jish al-Islam opened fire at protesters yesterday and wounded 10 civilians. They also include the only neurology doctor in eastern Ghouta. The fighters also threw dirty sewage at protesters. Jish al-Islam said those fighters will be held accountable. The only loser of the infighting are the people. The regime is taking advantage of the situation and trying to take back control of eastern Ghouta. As you know, the regime has deported most of the opposing towns in Damascus suburbs to northern Syria. And the only place left in eastern Ghouta, and if Ghouta falls into the regime's hands, it would be the end of the revolution. Because the only way to topple the regime is to do so in the capital. And the Syrian regime has bombed the southern city of Dara, killing at least 11 civilians, including several children. A helicopter struck the rebel-held part of the city. The bombs hit an area housing internally displaced people. About 20 others were wounded.